going to do a short video uh, to explain the trade that I took today. Okay, so Monday, which is not supposed to be a very active day for me. Okay, so um, yes, what happened? Okay, so my, when I woke up, this had already formed. Okay, the market had already created this move. All right, so on one hour. One hour, I saw that price I had created had broken out of this. Okay, had broken out of this resistance. Okay, and as engulfed, so I was looking for a pullback into this engulfing candle. Okay, to look for a sell. All right, so up here. So up here on 15 minutes there was a good pattern right a very good pattern here called the SNRC2 okay from here okay called the SNRC2 so you can see it clearly on five minutes okay so on five minutes yes the pattern was visible here all right so when the market got here right on 15 minutes we had a very beautiful engulfing so the 15 minute can candle this particular one this particular one was engulfed okay so we had an engulfing here all right so that was my first entry that engulfing so how did i take the trade i went to five minutes around that same engulfing right same engulfing and then i drew a trend line from here to here okay so i drew a trend line okay so the first thing is that i just didn't draw the trend line okay price was coming from a fifth uh, 15 minute snlc2 which is the same as 30 minute engulfing so you can see there is an engulfing somewhere here price rejected it on one minute okay so there was a rejection on one minute okay so in one minute after the rejection there was a one minute qm here okay this one minute qm okay so with this one minute QM, right, I draw a trend line, okay, and I have a QMC. Okay, so I think no. So the one minute QM, right, so I got a trade somewhere here, right, in here we have an SNLC2. SNLC2 in here, SNLC2. So I got the first trade here, and I think I exited around this level. Okay, so I hesitated, but then my whole setup was here. I was looking for a buy around this level. Looking for a buy around this level. Why? Because that was a 30 minutes engulfing. Okay, 30 minutes engulfing, lower time frame, 15 minutes, gives you a QMC. Right now, I was expecting an early pullback, okay, so that it will be. Uh, it will be adjacent or to be able to touch this trend line here so I was expecting a pullback here a price went up up here and then broke the trend line but still I got a trade I got this particular one price moved up here to this level and then it swept <laughs> my so my stop loss was here okay and I hadn't moved my stop loss to break even as at this particular because i went in big because it's a big uh, good setup okay this uh some of the setup that i don't play with so when price hit it all right i went in big i think i had one position one lot size um another two position was 0 0.05 in total i had about four lot size in it okay so price got here 
I close, I think I close just one and then it swept my stop loss. Okay, so it swept my stop loss. And then, okay, looking at the reaction, right, I you realize that it was a stop hunt. Okay, and that price was looking for this level. Okay, so this initial entry point, this initial entry point, okay, became liquidity for this entry. Right, so I understood it quickly and then added more position. I took more, uh, entered more here, right? Entered more here and allowed it to run. So on the way up, I started scalping because now direction is confirmed. Direction was already confirmed early in the morning. That's why I wanted to buy here. It was confirmed by the 4H, okay? All right, so price which at this four hour engulfing. Right, or you could say daily, okay, daily SNR, right? But four hour engulfing. So now direction is confirmed. So here I took the buy, added a lot of positions, and then I started. I went to five minutes and started trading only on the five minutes, okay? So first entry, I got this second entry here, okay? My other entries were here somewhere around this. Okay, so I got an entry here. Okay, and this was a QMM. All right, so QMM, QMM, this level. Yes, so that's my first, my second entry. So I got in here, exited here. Exited here, okay. Price came back, I got in here. I got in somewhere around this level, okay? Because this gave me a five minute engulfing, I think so, yes. Right, so five minute engulfing, entered here, okay? And I was supposed to exit at the top here. Price didn't hit my exit and came back. Then I took this one again. All right, so I entered here. I entered here couldn't hit my take profit price came down here and I added a position now this the beautiful thing that happened here is this okay look here trend line boom okay so the confluence trend line okay I drew the trend line touching the body of the candle the close okay close and then QMM in line again so the first qm that was taken was taken on the one minute this is a five minute qmm okay so i added position here all right and then i exited most of my trades here allows the allow the rest to run and my first target was here okay so i got this one all right i got this one and up here there was Okay, four minute, uh, four hour SNR. Okay, that has a miss. Okay, so let me clear everything. Four hour SNR, that has a miss. Okay, so that was my target. That was, that area was my target. After that, I stopped trading. Okay, so now let me show you. And today my guys did good. Okay, they were amazing amazing the academy all right so we started early in the morning early in the morning around 7 a.m they started posting their trades okay so this is yan posted his trade very beautiful trades okay this is good but now i was now waking up but my guys were already killing the market all right so that's yan okay nice trade Nice street, I think it's an SNLC one. Yes, it's an see one base. Okay. Alright. This is later. Okay, and nice one. The cell, good cell. Okay, that beautiful good cell. Okay. From the SNLC2. You see where the take profit is. It means a person understands the patterns. Okay. So then okay so th these are my trades okay this were my trades go 
so this is the one the first entry that i got stopped i'll see where my stop loss is and my this is one minute chart my stop loss is very tight okay so i got stopped out another time so this is where i added position after the stop loss while we disturb this low i added more position okay now this is okay okay so this is my first entry on the uh, qmm one minute qmm so i entered 555 0 0.50 and i exited at the top here now see when price uh came back okay when price came back when price came back i just took another entry here all right okay so this is where it came to the five minute qmm i took an entry right so this remember i told you guys that i took an entry but they didn't hit the stick profits but it came down and i added one more position so these are the positions this i took here it went up you can see the dots okay the dots signify the entry point so i entered here so when i enter it is just where it's going to reverse so i entered here it went up okay i entered here it went up but failed to take a profit and then came down to this level and i entered again then so this is the reason for the entry then uh, this is uh, mid empty four and then it started flying okay so this is my